Bah, tu me sors de Okay, so um, now I would like to introduce um, Mr. Panina, our PhD student in political education, and Dr. Dalaran, our examiner, and Dr. Tosotiri, also examiner. And Dr. Von Petri is not available today, but he will provide more comments later. Okay, so we have to go ahead with our different um, session now. Mr. Farina, please introduce yourself and start your presentation. Thank you. Okay, first of all, I would like to say thank you, uh, Dr. Sonye, for giving me the opportunity to do the defense. And um, thank you, uh, Dr. Nora and Dr. Tui Sotiri. So um, it's my pleasure today to do the presentation about my uh, PhD defense. Can you see the screen I'm sharing? Can you see that? Yes, 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 sure. Okay, so um, let me start, thank you. So this is my uh, research proposal different topic. What factors affecting employment satisfaction of academic staff at the higher education institutions? A case study of selected universities in uh, Cambodian provinces. So I am Dina Pan and from um, College of Education in Educational Science, UC University. So in my pr presentation, there will be three chapters. Chapter one is about introduction, and chapter two, literature review, and chapter three, methodology. So the introduction, yeah, um, job play important role in human life and job satisfaction is an effective factor in individual working. That's why um, academic and researcher believe that job satisfaction has direct impact on employee performance at uh, many level. And because job satisfaction is really important in employees' life, that's why most of them spend a lot of their working time in the workplace. And when academic staff become committed and very productive, they tend to work in systematically to achieve the good results. So not different from other employees, teachers also need motivation in order to perform well to improve their satisfaction. And job satisfaction also influences the behavior and attitudes of the employees and also teachers at the institution. And intrinsic motivation is the most effective way and it's also more influences on uh, teacher motivation in order to remain or enter in lecture and teaching. So teacher job satisfaction really has a crucial relationship with the remunerative, for example, like salary and non-remunerative incentive like, uh, for example, management. That's why um, in terms of pay, university instructor are very certified, lightly certified, and uh, most of them are certified with the involvement of the university, for example, like management and career advancement. So that the university role is to identify the expectation and aspiration in order to create good working environment so they can certify the employee and uh, teachers. That, that's why if they have the, the talented employee or high committed, then they become the most valuable resources for the institution. And it's very important to reward them so that they can function well and more effectively in order to bring the success to the institution. That's why institutional goodwill and outcome depend on its motivated workforce committed and dedicated. It can bring success or failure to the institution's goal if the employees are certified or decertified with their employment. Okay, so um, the statement of the problem is that we, we can see that Cambodian schooling fails to equip learners with the knowledge, skill and attitude so that they need it to succeed in the upper middle income country. And in today's culture, we can see that teaching is not an attractive job 
because um, the salary pay is very low, there are a lot of workload for them, and there is a limited opportunity for them in order to advance their career as well as um, personal growth. Um, the, the salary is paid generally based on their uh, educational level regardless of the location. So many instructors or teachers try to relocate from the rural area to the urban schools. And because of uh, limited education budget and financial rewards, uh, education institution risk poor quality and the loss of instructors, which affect the teaching focus according to um, a Master Power 2013 and Dream 2021. So um, we can see that some motivated teachers, they use their own pocket money to upgrade their qualification. They go to private university and then uh, they become very dissatisfied when they got back to work. They didn't get promoted and in terms of salary as well, that's why they are not happy. Yep, um, I have three statements of hypothesis. Intrinsic motivation influences job satisfaction of academic staff at the selected Cambodian provincial based universities. And hypothesis two, extrinsic motivation influences job satisfaction of academic staff at selected Cambodian province and university. And uh, third, job motivation influences job satisfaction of academic staff. And the theoretical framework I use um, Huthberg and his colleagues in 1959 about motivation, which is um, intrinsic motivation and intrinsic motivations. So intrinsic motivation is um, a, a, a factor that increase and improve the satisfaction. So sometimes it is called a motivator factors. And extrinsic motivation is also called hygiene factors. It is when people get dissatisfied by the, the surrounding environment. However, with the presence of the hygiene factor, it, it did not increase the, the satisfaction. Because extrinsic motivation or factor is like um, a, a healer. It, it's not a healer, but it's rather a preventive. So it just prevents from the 75. And um, it influences job employment satisfaction. Job satisfaction described as a positive or a pleasant emotional state that results from um, individual appreciate of their job and performance, according to Locke, 1969, 70, and um, 76. Yep, um, the motivational theory, according to the Hathberg et al., uh, 1959, they classify it into two intrinsic motivation and extrinsic motivation. And job satisfaction theory, according to the Viru, 1969, in his definition, reflected the role of employee at work. And Locke described job satisfaction as <coughs> sorry, <coughs> as a positive or a pleasant emotional state that results from individual appreciation of their jobs and performance. And here is the research framework I'm doing uh, in the framework of uh, Hussberg motivation hygiene theory, which divided into two, uh, we can classify into two, uh, motivator factors and hygiene factors. So in motivator factors, we have uh, dimension uh, one to six here, and <clears throat> hygiene factors from um, the nine dimension, mean uh, salary inter personal and uh, to job security. So influences the uh, employment job satisfaction, which is um, dependent variable. <coughs> yeah, um, according to the Stankoska 2017 academic staff 
refer to those who primarily responsible for three things is that teaching, research, and service, and those personnel who got the title, for example, professor, associate professor, assistant professor, or other equivalent, for example, can be vice chancellor, dean, or vice dean, and other professions. How, however, it's not a student teacher or a teacher's aides. To job satisfaction, let uh, repeat it like uh, Spectre 1997. It's about how individuals feel about their employment and various aspects. And uh, motivation is originally from a uh, Latin word means uh, move. So motivation comes from motive, reflects the um, desire, the needs and want that drive within the individuals. So um, the, the study focused solely on academic staff at public uh, higher education. And we have three research questions here. Uh, research question one, to identify subject uh, factor of intrinsic affecting employment satisfaction and objective two, discover factor of intrinsic affecting employment satisfaction and uh, to examine the influences of job motivation. So in order to achieve the objective, I got three uh, research questions. And the significance of uh, the study is that the result finding would offer a better understanding to the university and how to comply with the employment satisfaction. Also, the provide them the guidance so that they can increase the job satisfaction level and academic performance. And more importantly, is to attract the experience and qualify uh, academics and especially to reduce the turnover. And for the management level and policy maker, um, provide them the basic concept so that they understand the factors that they can benchmark or indicate the, the uh, uh, factor that affect the job satisfaction. And they can deal or address the emerging problem and challenges in the institutions. And to the scholar and researcher, it extend the limited literature review uh, currently available in Cambodia and promote more in deep studies. To the limitation of uh, the study is uh, the population might not allow the generalization for Cambodian higher education as a whole and the number of the female is less. Uh, the, the other thing is that the unwillingness of the respondent to, uh, to fill out the questionnaires. So um, because the same poll is subject to by us, uh, we, are, we cannot guarantee that this is 100% uh, precise. Yeah, the uh, chapter 2 is about literature review. So I review the, uh, the motivations to work by Hertzberg with uh, uh, motivated factors function to uh, maximize satisfaction and hygiene of factor that uh, have to minimize dissatisfaction with the totally uh, 15 uh, 14 dimensions <clears throat> so there are there are a lot of research gaps um, we had the previous study some conduct the study uh, only about intrinsic motivation and some other conduct intrinsic motivation while few other conduct both but none of them use all the indicators like dimension that have presented previously. And to Cambodian context, very few conducted on uh, job satisfaction at higher education. Uh, only uh, I have found few of them, for example, like Kim 2013 and Hua 2020s. So other population gap is we have small uh, sample size of females uh, as the participants. Sorry, okay. So in chapter three, the, we apply the quantitative approach and I conduct the pilot study with the uh, 30 academic staff from the CSUK, GSM uh, University of Kham Chai Mia. So the, this is the uh, population and the, the target group that I'm going to uh, collect the data as a population and sample size. So I have pilot study with the uh, GSM Kham Chai 
University of Kong Chai Mi uh, as a pilot study, and I will target the two university. One is a Swiding University, and the other is a, a University of Hei Samran Tabong Khmong in uh, Tabong Khmong provinces. And according to the Israel 1992, uh, I'm going to uh, conduct the interview and collect the data with about 112. And in the, the pilot study and procedure, so I, I first explain the objective of uh, the data collection and I have to clarify the structure of the questionnaire and then the participant, they work on the individual, they give the feedback. So after I collect the feedback, I revise the questionnaire and and then finally, I will uh, uh, collect and ask them to fill the, the questionnaire from all the participa uh, participants. And I'm using the Cronbach Alpha to uh, test the reliability. And here, uh, job satisfaction with the uh, 24 item. We have that um, between 0 0.89 or uh, 0.9, it, it was good. So it's the reliability is good and the motivation of intrinsic is 0 0.831 with the six item and so the reliability is um, good as well and the motivation of intrinsic with nine item um, it's acceptable with the reliability so um, in the data collection and analysis I'm using the SPS version 23 with the questionnaire and I'm using a file like a scale and um, I do the uh, mean and the standard deviation. So also I use a correlation coefficient in order to test the uh, hypothesis 3 then I expected I expect that I will get the strong positive between 0 0.6 0 0.79 which uh, present the strong positive according to the um, uh, Chiu Hari Itel uh, 2015. So I'm using the APA 7 edition with the calculation from uh, Mendeley. And that's all for my presentation. Thank you. Okay, thank you so much, uh, Mr. Nina, for your networking. And finally, you reached the uh, proposal to the stage. Now, I would like to invite Dr. Nara for providing comments and recommendations.